My name is Carol Beach and I decided to do the oleander plant because it's one of the most poisonous plants on the earth. Um, it grows in the Mediterranean. It's usually pink or magenta like the one I have here. The leaves grow in groups of three on the stem, which is kind of interesting. And I also painted the oleander hawk moth. The oleander grows in the Mediterranean. It's very hardy. It can uh, withstand really harsh soil conditions and a lot of wind. The ancient Romans used to plant it in their gardens. And you can see the oleander plant painted in some of the frescoes of Pompeii. The oleander has four major poisons. Uh, oleandrin, Narian, Oleandricide, and Dingitoxygen. They're very strong poisons. If you ingest any part of the plant at all, from the flowers to the leaves to the stems and even the roots, you can get uh, pretty badly poisoned. It acts on your nervous system, your respiratory system, and your digestive system. So you can have symptoms like difficulty breathing, dizziness, brain fog, and a lot of digestive issues. So I wouldn't recommend ingesting it for any reason. Now the hawk moth was introduced to the oleander as a way of kind of keeping it under control because the hawk moth uh, lays eggs on it and the caterpillars hatch and they eat the leaves. The caterpillars are completely resistant to all the poisons. So that's why I have the hawk moth in my picture. Um, the oleander also does another thing. It does um, deceit pollination. And deceit pollination is where it attracts pollinators, but it doesn't have any nectar. So the pollinators come to the plant, uh, they uh, go into the blossoms, they start looking around for the nectar, they pick up the pollen, but they go off frustrated because there's basically no nectar. So it's a, a very difficult plant. It's a tough uh, little gangster plant, and that's why I enjoyed painting it. And that's the story of the oleander.